Welcome back to the job site. In this video, I want to share with you a real simple tip that's going to help you get precise cuts on a miter saw. And it's basically what's called creeping up to the cut line. And it's, you know, when you're making these cuts, you have your, your pencil line or your pen line where you want to make the cut. And typically you want to cut on the waist side of that line because you don't want your material to be short. So let's just say that I got this panel molding here and I'm gonna put a line right there. I'm gonna go ahead and swing this to 45 because it's a panel molding. And I'm gonna make this cut, this 45 miter, right there on my line. And what I'm gonna do is cut more on the waist side. So that's gonna be this side over here that I'm not gonna keep. We're gonna pretend like this is my actual piece that I'm trying to keep. So you're gonna see me cut about an eighth to a quarter heavy on that waist side where I drew that X on that side of the line. And then I'm gonna creep up on it just using my hand and thumb technique on, in my left hand. So without the piece in my hand, I'm gonna show you what I'm doing. I'm gonna plant my hand against the base of the saw like this, and then I'm moving the material with my thumb. So my thumb is like a micro adjuster. So let's put the piece in my thumb. Hand is firmly against the base of the saw. Thumb is a micro adjuster. So as I made that cut you just seen, what I was doing was, so I, I saw the first cut, it wasn't good, it was about a quarter over or so, I don't remember. So then my thumb comes into place and I push it a little bit more. Okay, now I'm a 16th away. All right, I can see that. Now my thumb pushes a little bit more. Now I'm right on the money. So that's all it is. It's just this movement right here is one simple tip to get these things super precise, but it's all in my thumb moving it. So that's a simple tip Hopefully you learned something from this video. It's something we use on a daily basis. And if you want me to share more of these little tips, let me know in the comments and we'll see y'all on the next video. Take care.